Tiny houses are popping up all over my grandmother's South Central L.A. neighborhood. After 15 years of living abroad as a traveling English teacher, I am finally back home in Los Angeles and looking for a place to rent. Of course, the ideal of a tiny house within walking distance of my grandmother's house was ideal. I went to check one out. It was beautiful, new, and it had everything I needed to live a happy life in LA or to begin to live a happy life. The rent was 1500 something I can do. I make double that as an online English and art teacher. The company advertised itself as affordable rent, affordable rent option in Los Angeles. So I applied. After applying, I was sent the requirements to um, be eligible for renting this. I needed to make triple the rent price, which would be $4,500 a month. I don't make that. The company will refund my application fee of $35, but the point is the company advertised itself as affordable rent to help with the crisis, um, the housing crisis here in Los Angeles. But having to make triple the rent is not helping the situation. It's just shedding light on the real problem here which is the rent situation in L.A. is out of control. I don't understand how <laughs> people say that they are trying to create an affordable rent option when you have to make triple the rent. This makes me think that gentrification is finally coming to my grandma's South Central L.A. neighborhood. It's right next to Inglewood, where there's the new sports center, a shopping center and other things popping off there. Where will I end up in my beloved hometown, Los Angeles?